The Samsung X5 is a portable solid state drive. On paper, it has a read speed up to 2800 megabytes per second and write speed up to 2300 megabytes per second. I will try some real life testing to see how fast it is on my setup. I can already say that the results that I got is slower than advertised. The speed is depending on things like your system and your connections. My specific setup is macOS Monterey on a 16 inch MacBook Pro M1. This is actually a really fast MacBook. It has a lot of processing power and the internal hard drive is significantly faster than the Samsung X5. So I feel confident that my setup won't be a bottleneck in this test. The speed can also depend on the file system and I'm using APFS. I'm using Blackmagic, which is a free program that's available on App Store. It writes a 5GB file on your drive and then it reads the same file. The writing speed is stabilizing around 2150, which is actually slightly slower than 2300. Then it's reading faster at about 2650, which also is a bit slower than advertised. This might be because of the APFS file system and this drive might work faster on other platforms and other file systems. But this is the number that I get. For me this is good enough. I will use it to edit 1080 footage and 4K footage in H.265. According to the green checks in the table it's fully sufficient. And that's also my real life experience when I'm editing videos. The Samsung X5 is super fast. But as you can see here in the lower right corner, the Samsung X5 is not fast enough for 12K H.265. So if you are editing 12K H.265 videos, the Samsung X5 is not the external hard drive for you. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions regarding this, or if you want me to do a more detailed review of the Samsung X5. Thanks for watching!